I am something. I am something. I don't get electricity every day. Doom so doom so light of eyes. I am something. Gold. I did not win it. Silver. I did not win it. Stainless. I did not win it. I have star. But well, I don't shine. Grammy. I have never won in my life. If you come ordinary jollof rice, I cannot cook it. But I can cook egg, fry egg, roast egg, steam egg, parboil egg. Hi Siri. Please, who am I? Sister decided to bring full Hiroshima nuclear bomb to a fight that requires just a stick. Our Nigerian sister ate and left no chance for a rematch. I have a star, but I don't shine. Jesus. <laughs> Nadia paid pass. Please, why did you come to a knife fight with a machine gun? <laughs> our earring understood the assignment. You guys noticed that our earring was actually a star, like a star-shaped earring. I don't know if that was deliberate or if it was coincidental because I don't want to believe she deliberately looked for a star-shaped earring just for this. <laughs> Hey my lovelies, welcome back to my channel. Hey Chimo, this one is too much. Oh God have mercy. Hey, see, Simi has already warned. <laughs> Simi has warned some people that don't come for Nigerians when it comes to Bantao. That's to before warned is to before I'm do. Have you people forgotten? Look, if you're not emotionally strong, you should never, ever, ever get in a word fight with a Nigerian. To be forewarned is to be forewarned. When a Nigerian gets in a word fight with you, they are fighting to win. All bets are off. All bets are definitely off here because what is this? <laughs> what is this? Oh Lord, have mercy. In fact, let me just read some of the comments. Nigerian lady ate Ghana for breakfast. I love it. Finish them. Ghanaians are crying. They didn't see this coming. That's why I said, but Ghana, they get power outages well and now. Hmm. And <laughs> sister decided to bring full Hiroshima nuclear bomb to a fight that requires just a stick. This Niger babe don't finish Ghana. See list and counting. Ghana seems too much. <laughs> Even the power supply they used to have don't downgrade now. The star but cannot shine was a knockout. The Nigerians in us are proud of you sis. You ate and left no crumbs. That our Nigerian sister represents us well. One AC for you. <laughs> As I said, find this girl for me, represent us well. From the way that Nigerian woman was moving her camera, I knew she won. <laughs> the sis, why did you come to a knife fight with a machine gun? <laughs> Finish her. <laughs> I said, I am tired. These people can't even banter. If we decide to take this disrespect up, it will turn to a matter of national emergency. They are already protesting for their national team's failure. I have a star, but I don't shine. Jesus. <laughs> Nadia paid pass. Our sis ate and left no crumbs. She thought she ate a nerve. Sis, raise them, raise them. No be like. <laughs> Ghana wants to start wasting their power. No feet reach. You were not told that be. I said, Nigeria and Ghana just did toxic relationship. <laughs> and the other one said, nothing can break the sweet relationship and bond between both countries. Not even the Jollof Rice War. Said, normally we don't need light to shine. We glow in the dark. I said, almost just one person, bad mouth. Imagine the whole Nigeria. That woman representing us needs to be given national honor. Nigeria is proud of you, sis. Use your lights to light up your star and make it shine. <laughs> Our earring understood the assignment. You guys noticed that our earring was actually a star, like a star shaped earring. I don't know if that was deliberate or if it was coincidental because I don't want to believe she deliberately looked for a star shaped earring just for this. <laughs> and you know, fish shake Nigerians, we shake ourselves for a living. As so I said, when will Ghana learn that we yab for a living? Hmm. Guys, also remember that man that I made a video about recently that also talked about guy, Nigerians coming for him and that he learned his lesson, he learned the hard way. Nigerians are exempt. Like, the last thing I want is a massive wave of Nigerians dragging me on my own account. In fact, this is, is no show mercy at all. Eh? <laughs> God of mercy. Honestly, eh, even though I'm Nigerian, I just always wonder how do most Nigerians come up with these things? Because always, do they have a book somewhere where they write these things down? I mean, do these things really just come to their heads? Because even though I do, I say some things that some people find really hilarious. I'm like, oh, is it just natural in every Nigerian's DNA? I don't even understand, but seriously, eh? <laughs> my God, yeah, my comments in Ghana, please, eh? Let us not, let us not see. Just in Nigeria, you can't shame the shameless. You cannot shame the shameless. So let me just tell you. Anyways, 
as I always say, somebody's to come for me is still all love. Let me just tell you. <laughs> I be mean, whatever made it a Ghanaian sister to, to start the drag, eh, to start the banter. Anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and please be civil in the comments. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.